way the Kings scored in the four games you got last year, is this a good test of the progress that you've made since then? Uh, yeah, I think every game, every NBA game is a good test because every every NBA team is different and uh, you know throws different looks at us. So I mean, I'm def definitely excited about the game, see what we can build off the next game, try to get a streak going. Um, but yeah, like I said, every 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 game's a test. But not everybody averaged 135 years. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I mean, they were great offensive teams. Yeah, for sure. Um, but this is a completely different team um, than it was last year, and um, I think that we have a, a pretty good defensive unit, defensive team, and um, you know, I, I, I'm excited about the game. Because you're the guy that's been here the last few years, right? The, the, longest senior guy. I mean, how much does Ime and the rest of the coaching staff kind of lean on you to understand where guys are relative to kind of where they've been in the past? Kind of talking about strengths, weaknesses, that kind of stuff. Uh, yeah, I mean, like I said, uh, these guys have been around the, the NBA. A lot of these coaches are coming from NBA teams. So, um, you know, they watch a lot of film. They already knew, you know, our strengths and weaknesses before we got here. Um, I think uh, now we're just trying to implement them within the group that we have. And I think we're uh, learning each other every game, every practice. We're learning a little bit more about each other. But um, ultimately, it's just going to come down to continue to communicate on the defense team. It seemed like you had a really nice connection with the men. How tough is it to see him go down and yeah. continue to get better? Yeah, I mean, you know, it's always tough. Um, but, you know, it's a long season. It's real early. And uh, he'll bounce back from this. Cause, I mean, one thing about a man, the time that I spent with him, um, he's a hard worker. He's a guy that checks every box every day he comes in. So uh, he won't be out too long. And, you know, we're going to miss him, but we'll be excited when he gets back out there with us. What is it about him? What is it about that? Sorry. I'm back with Aaron Holiday, that's like I mean, great. I mean, he's he's a, another four general for us. Um, another guy who's been been around for a few years, and he brings that defensive nastiness that we need, uh, you know, crawling up into ball handlers, but also his paint touches, which uh, collapse the defense and him making the right plays. So he just adds another uh, another piece to our to our team. So, um, the first two years of your career, you know, you played just about every game, but last year was, you know, kind of injury play. Um, was there any type of conversations you had with Tari Eason knowing that he's, you know, started the season going through something similar? Yeah. Uh, like I said, kind of the same thing with um, the men, like, Sorry's a guy who doesn't miss a lot of games so over his whole career. I don't think he's, he's missed almost any. So um, this is just a, a time to just focus on and control what you can control. And like I said, it's a very long season. And we're only, what, four games in. Um, so uh, we miss him out there. And, um, you know, he's doing everything he can to get back out here as fast as he can. And his impact is going to be needed when he's getting back. When you look at the Kings and you see some of the way that they run offense through Sabonis, so you kind know, of have a feel for that's something that this team can achieve? Yeah, I mean, we just got to match his physicality. Um, I think, you know, you guys have seen Alfie the last few games. I think he's been doing a tremendous job. Um, Jock, getting Jock back uh, out there. Just, just throwing multiple bodies at him and making it hard not to get to his spots and um, doing our work early because he is a big guy. Yep.